Hey everybody, it's Comp Help. Thank you for watching this video. In this video, I will be unboxing some stuff here, such as my graphics card and my operating system OEM disc. Um, it's actually Windows 7 64 bit. Sorry, I have to hold my camera. It's, uh, yeah, my tripod. I just totally broke it. So, anyways, I have like the live stream going on right here. So, I don't know if you guys can see anyone in the chat, but say hello to YouTube. Say hello, YouTube. Hi. Hey, YouTube. Hi. <laughs> Alright. So, you see, I have, like, a live stream going on. I don't have that many people on, because I only tweeted it, like, a few, like, a minute ago or so. So, whatever. That's fine. These are the people who, who are cool. You guys are cool. Whoever's watching live. Because, well, yeah. You guys listen to my tweets and stuff. Alright, there we go. So, I finally have this box open here. The box is open. I want the live stream to see this. There's nothing really going on, but it's a box. Okay. Paper is off. Paper's off. Alright. The live stream's like, oh my gosh, I can't see anything. Oh no, oh no. And, well. Well, 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 yes, this video is going on YouTube for the people in chat. Here's my graphics card box. Wow, that thing's pretty big. Alright, so this is the ATI Firepress V7800. Um, this is not a gaming card. I'm going to repeat, this is not a gaming card. Uh, my profession is going to be in what I'm going to study in college is animation, so I wanted a workstation graphics card. So, yeah, that's why I didn't get some some gaming card. Anyways, a lot of people are still confused on that, and whatever. And I guess here's Microsoft uh, Windows 7, 64-bit. So anyways, uh, let's go ahead and unbox this. I'm going to go ahead and put the camera down for a bit. Sorry if it was really shaky. Can't really help that. My hands are kind of shaky right now, just because. Alright, let me go ahead and... Uh, Open up the plastic from this box. All right, so we have the plastic off of the box. All right, let's go ahead and uh, open this. Let's see how is this supposed to open? I have arrows pointing this way is up. So, uh, let's see, what the heck, let me use my hip here, use my hip, hold the box in place, oh my gosh, this is such a hassle, hold on, come on, get out, off you go, okay, so now I have like a, uh, cardboard box going on here, okay, that actually might be better than me holding it and stuff. Alright, so, uh, let's open it here. Those people in the live chat or live stream actually have a better view than you guys, which is why you guys should have been there. I'm kidding. We just got some papers here, some configurations, some awesome foam. Oh, what's this? We have a, uh, display port to VGA, or I mean, uh, DVI. It's just like a uh, conversion plug there, and some more adapters here. Okay, great, some more foam. And what do you know? Right here, what, what do I have right here? What do I have right here? I have this really, really long graphics card. Oh my gosh, this thing is huge. Whoa, almost fell. All right, you know, I'm gonna I'm gonna measure how long this thing is because this thing is like. Long. Hold on. Get this box down really quick. All right. Wow, this thing is huge. Okay. So I'm going to show you guys right here what I have. Workstation graphics card. Um, I read some blog on it, and it said it is because it's a single slot, as you can see. It is the most powerful single slot graphics card out there right now. So wow, that thing is crazy. So let's go ahead and measure how big it is. Just because. 
I conveniently place measuring tape in my room for this purpose. So, let's see. I'm going to go ahead and This thing is about 11 inches long. Yeah, it actually is 11 inches long, pretty much. Yep. So, this graphics card is 11 inches long. It is almost a foot long, guys. This thing is huge. Okay. So there we go. That's the graphics card. I'll be unboxing that in a video. I mean, uh, installing it in a video right now. But um, let me go ahead and unbox or unwrap the Windows 7 disc here. Oh, come on. It's all like stuck in there. <sighs> so, I think in the uh, HAF 922 case, I think it can hold up like 12 and a half inches, so like a foot and a half of an inch, or three uh, or 13 inches. I'm not sure, but I measured it and I and I uh, brought out the uh, this is to live stream. I'm talking to live stream. I brought out the uh, measuring tape to 12 inches just to make sure, because I heard it was uh, just over 11 inches. And it should fit in my case. So, yeah. these plastic things are a pain. So, anyways, I got Windows 7 64 bit. Um, and this is the OEM disk. Pretty much, I didn't want to spend to get like uh, a whole box and everything and the help support because really, like, I can kind of help myself <laughs> when it comes to this kind of stuff. You know? And if I can't, I know. Like community out there or lockergnome.net will answer it or something, you know? So, I mean, come on. Who who uses, like, the support for Windows and stuff? I know I don't. I've used support for, like, HP because I have an HP laptop and they're total garbage. Would anybody else agree? Like, I don't know. It's garbage. I can find better information on Google and stuff. Whatever, you know, just, just rip this stupid box. Alright, so I have some piece of paper there. And here it is, the Windows 7 disk. I don't know if I should hide that. Windows 7 disk there. You guys see it in the live stream? Okay. There we go. That's pretty awesome. Uh, Windows 7 Professional, 64 bit. Said that like a zillion times in this video, I think. But there we go. That's the unboxing of all my stuff. I'll catch you guys later. Sorry for the bad ca camera angles. At least the lighting was a lot better. Bye.